uh, Yolanda Adams, who were both from Houston, Texas, to pick up a cell phone and say, hey. This is the interview that will air today on Tamron Hall with Kim Burrell. Okay, Kim's beef is none of her gospel friends stuck by her side. They didn't call her to tell her anything. They just disassociated themselves. They just um, didn't have her back. Okay, so she named Yolanda Adams out specifically. Now, what you also need to see is Tamron Hall. I talked about being loyal to, you, to your friends. I respect Tamron Hall now so much more. When Kimberly mentions Yolanda Adams, she let her, uh, Tamron let her finish her statement. Tamron Hall said, you know what? That's not what I asked you. You named this woman out. That is my friend as well. And I can't let you sit here and, you know, talk about her like this because, boy, well, she's not there. And this is what I'm talking about. Your real friends will have your back. Your real friends will defend you. Now, okay, that's that. Kim. Now, girl, I feel you. Your friends, this will have your back, but your friends should also. you right. She could have called you and said, girl, shut the fuck up. Because I said that in the beginning. Somebody should have called you or pulled your coattail. Kim, just shut up. It's okay to believe what you want to believe, think what you want to think. But them people, now, while, like you said, in the green room, we had our own conversations. We talked. You, you right. Because they probably agree with you about the gays. Probably can't stand the gays. A whole lot of church people can't. A whole lot of gospel artists don't like the gays. Hell, some R&B artists that don't like the gays either. And they probably did say, because y'all in the green room, ain't no cameras back there. So, it's just us talking one-on-one. We having kitchen, what I call kitchen table talk. Yeah. It's a whole lot of shit that I say on, in private. I would never say on social media. And I ain't even no celebrity. But if people really knew there's some shit that I believe and some shit that I say to my friends, like me and my BFF talk. Yeah. Uh-uh. Some things you don't say in public. So, Kim, you right. Your friend should have called you. Girl, shut the fuck up. Now, they're not finna fuck up their bag. Y'all friends, y'all cool. But, bitch, I'm not finna fuck up my money. No. Absolutely not. I'm gonna get up here. I'm gonna sing about Jesus. And I'm gonna go on here and go about my business. Because, see, what people don't understand is, Kim, because you t- keep saying it's the gospel. It is the gospel. But the gospel music industry, it's a business. Church is a business. That's just some bullshit you believe in. But it's a business. Ain't nobody finna fuck up their business because of your bullshit. Just learn to shut the fuck up in public. You don't have to voice everything that you feel. I really hope you get that one day and you learn that. It's okay to believe what you believe, but you don't have to broadcast, especially in the industry that you're in. Because the industry that you're in is controlled by the homosexuals. So, girl, yeah, yeah, they're going to put their 